Some Minneapolis police officers risked their lives when a car ran off a bridge and flipped over onto Interstate 94. This video of the fiery rescue was shot by someone driving by early last Wednesday. Today, the officers met the family of the driver of the car. WCCO's Reg Chapman has more on what the officers saw that made them jump into action. Traffic camera video shows the car traveling at a high rate of speed, veering off Washington Avenue through a barrier and flipping over the concrete wall. The car barely missed a vehicle traveling westbound on 94 before coming to rest against the middle barrier. Officers Crystal Fallon and Ryan Davis were close by when the call came out about the accident just north of the 41st Avenue Bridge. And we had to dodge vehicles, uh, construction equipment, and uh, the debris from the crash. Traffic was whizzing by as the officers checked to see if anyone was trapped inside. Officer Fallon ran to the back of the vehicle where she saw a woman in the back seat and the driver belted and trapped inside. I was able to get underneath her armpits and just pull her out. Two people passing by stopped to help the officers pull the driver from the car. Then one of them actually took one of our knives and went in there and cut the seatbelt for us as we were pulling them out. And by the time we were really able to get them out, we had flames up to our point in the car. Video shows the officers performing CPR on driver Lloyd Cunningham. He did not survive, but his passenger did. Cunningham's family returned to the scene to meet the two who risked their own lives to save others. Both officers say they didn't think, they just reacted. We do this job to help people, to save people, to protect people. Um, and when it comes down to it, I mean, that's your job. And it becomes more than something that you're just paid to do. It becomes your identity. Rich Chapman, WCCO, 4 News. Uh, police don't know the two people who stopped to help. Officers do say they deserve credit, though, for saving a life.